What's up everybody? Football season in Ohio begins in just a week and a half and for the Eastern Eagles they are looking to return to the playoffs for yet another season. Head coach Jason Jackson came in last year and led his squad to a playoff appearance and this year he expects even more from the team this season. Here's the football frenzy first look with the Eastern Eagles. The football frenzy first look sponsored by WVU Parkersburg. I'm ready. I mean I'm ready. It's right on the right on the edge. I'm so ready for the season to begin. The Ohio high school football season is just a week and a half away. For the Eastern Eagles, they are ready to continue showing what they are made of on the gridiron. It's great to be back. Uh, 2022 was a great year. Uh, we were new to the program and you know, basically the boys were new to us and being back in 2023, it's just, it's great to be back. And everybody knows us now, everybody understands, you know, our main vision and our main goals. And the kids last year, they did a great job with, you know, listening to us and wanting to get be a part of what we're doing. And this year it's just been a continuation of what we established and got, you know, become a little stronger even this year. So it's, it's great to be back. The biggest part of building a great program is preparing for the future. The leaders on Eastern's team are looking to help the next generation of Eagles. I had a lot of great mentors when I went through high school. I had, you know, I had Blake and Bryce Newland. They were two brothers that were extremely talented running backs. Um, and for me, I've kind of had to work a little extra hard to try to get on their kind of level. So to be able to show off some of the skills that I've learned and just some of the footwork drills and all that, some of the younger guys, is it feels pretty good. Being a leader is about more than just talking. It's about leading, and that's what these seniors are learning to do. I'm not, I'm not the best leader by, like, talking and telling them what to do, but I can go out and show. But every now and then I'll be like, you got to fix your stuff, and... I, I stay on them pretty well, and um, I make sure they're all in line. Take care of them, though. Last year, the Eagles were looked down on and went on to prove all the doubters wrong with an 8-2 and two season and a playoff appearance. They know all eyes will be on them to continue improving. I feel like we were kind of a little downers. Um, when people don't believe in you, it's kind of hard to rise up and rise past it, but we did. Um, and then this year we have pretty much everybody in Southeastern Ohio's support in terms of how good we can be and our potential. So that's the one thing. And the other thing is experience. Um, a lot of the guys on previous teams that we've had really didn't play much because they were very senior heavy. Um, so to have a bunch of young guys, we're mainly junior led right now with only I think six or seven seniors at the moment. So having that playoff experience from last year will really put us ahead in the game. Following up a season like last year's is a big deal. If they want to continue their big expectations, winning is a must this year. We just talked today, right? before we come out was expectations okay um, the expectation that we as coaches try to give to the guys is we expect to win and that's what we tried to teach them last year it's not being arrogant you know it's not being you know, you know like we're world beaters or anything it's just that we expect to put the work in do the right things, make the right decisions, and in the end, that should give us the expectation to meet, or meet that expectation to win. It's 10 passes we haven't caught any. Okay, down here. That will bring us to tonight's sports poll question. I want to know if you all believe the Eastern Eagles will make it back to the playoffs for a second straight season under head coach Jason Jackson. The results are in and the majority says they do believe the team will make the playoffs this year, and I'm very excited to see what they can do this upcoming year. Well, everybody, that is going to be 